I want to know, how was, how was being married to General Nguyen within those five months? Was it just fighting all, the, all of the time or? No. Was, no. It, was it love or was it, was it business? No, it was friendship. It was, it, was, it was going to be, supposed to be, and the intention was, and it was in many ways, a collaboration. I was going to uh, be the one who would be uh, taking care of the artistic side. Uh, uh, well, we played the inevitable game of golf, of course. Uh, uh, but in the, in the end, it was, uh, we just lived like two normal people. I was very, uh, on very good terms with Sanda, with Pio. I still see Pio. I, uh, and uh, it was something that had its big up, uh, big up explosions and and but then on the rest of it it was uh, uh, as long as it could have been kept like this I would have stayed on but the minute that I was no longer of any use to my people where I was going to be suspected and getting in the way of others I was not going to live with my hands tied I want to reiterate this question because I think it's so important many people would not leave the legacy as a princess anywhere in Burma, in Italy, they would not live, they would not leave their place as a princess to go to another place to, uh, you know, because, because they just think that it's, it's, you were, I know. All right. do you know what I mean? I don't know what you mean but what do you, what, I mean, what do you say to that? Like, what, did you follow your heart? Did you, did you do it because, because, because you're happy, you're happy. Listen. Being a princess is nothing that I invented. I'm not responsible for. It was something I grew into. Uh, I, I, I cannot be honored uh, because uh, I was that, all right? I was born that and that was that. But between being born something, loving something, you are here today. You see my house. Uh, it's beautiful I will, and it's passionate. Uh, Bur Burma is with me. It is. Uh, anybody who comes here automatically is in Burma. I, uh, my grandson said a very beautiful thing, and I think we should close on this because he was, it was so beautiful. The night we were going to leave Rangoon, I went into his room at the hotel, and I said to him, I said, Alex, well, how was this trip? Uh, uh, is it what you wanted? Were you happy? And he said, Granny, this trip, it has not been a journey. I have never felt uh, as a visitor. He says, I have lived here in these two weeks with all the people and the country the way you have taught me to live in your house and how we have lived at home. These are the words of my grandson. And this is how I live. I am what I am. I am not Italian, not Burmese, uh, not Australian, I am Buddhist. And that is my inheritance and that is the legacy I would like people to remember me for. And perhaps one or two recipes. <laughs> Thank you so much, Ante. You, you can take the girl out of Burma, but you can't take, take Burma out, out of the, the girl. girl. Exactly. Thank you, Thank you so much, Ante.